Hello and welcome to another documentation of Uplifting Post Tower and today we are going to take a look at the transit train at Frankfurt Airport. This transit train is a real classic that dates back to the 1990s and it still features the original trains that have been built back in the day, you know these old Bombardier trains. We are going to take a ride on the system and we are of course going to check out the elevators at the stations. This system goes from Terminal 1, Concourse A, wire Concourse B and Concourse C, to Terminal 2, Concourse D and E. And in the very near future, the system will be changed a lot. And from what I read, it will be turned into airside only. So we've got a good reason to take a look at it while it's still in the old state. The train has got a Schengen landside car and a non-Schengen airside car. And depending on which side you are, you enter the train from a different platform. Let's take a look at the system and take a ride before we get into the rest.
Tabelle 1, Bereiche A und Z. Bitte festhalten. Approaching Terminal 1, for courses A and Z. Please hold on to the handrails. Bitte lassen Sie kein Gepäck im Zug zurück. Please do not leave any luggage on the train. And now we will start at Terminal 1 Concourse A, but unfortunately there is not much to show here because only one of the platforms is still in use. The island platform, which for as far as I am aware of is the Schengen platform, is no longer in use. It features its own elevator, but sadly I can't show anything to you. And the same applies to the platform at the other end, which should be airside, but this one is also out of reach. So we instantly switch over to Terminal 1, Concourse B and Airport Railway Station. Terminal 1, Concourse B and Airport Railway Station, which features an island platform, which is landside, but for as far as I know it will soon be turned into airside, and two side platforms, which are already airside. Each of these platforms has got one elevator and we're going to take a look at all of these three elevators. Vier 
And now to the next station, which is Skyline Terminal 1 Concourse C. There's something I got to tell you about Frankfurt Airport. Even though you are at the airside platform, you are not clean. That is a big design error at Frankfurt Airport. For the most part, if you change between the terminals, you cannot stay clean as a traveler. Clean describes that you have passed a proper security control. So if you are traveling between the terminals by using the transit train in the non-Schengen area, you have to go through another security checkpoint to get to your plane. And as a result, changing planes here takes a lot longer than what it should do. Anyways, Terminal 1 Concourse C is an airside only station. That means if you're traveling in a landside car, the voice says no exit possible and the doors remain closed. There are two elevators in the station. Let's take a look at them. And now to the current last station of this line, Terminal 2, Concourse D and E. This one's got platform layout that's very similar to the Terminal 1 Concourse B station, however, it's the other way around. This time, the side platforms are landside and the island platform is airside.
Fahrt Terminal 2, Lukas Bereich D und I. Bitte festhalten. Approaching Terminal 2, Konkurses D und M. Please hold on to the handrails. Bitte lassen Sie keine Pegelzug zurück. Sadly, most of the elevators have been replaced, but there is still one original elevator from the 90s left, which is the scenic elevator at the side platform for the arriving trains that terminate here. Tür schließt. Door closing. Vierte Etage. Fourth floor. Tür öffnet. Doors opening. And now, that's it for now. Let's take a look into the future of the system. As I mentioned, the existing transit train will be turned airside only according to several information I found about this topic. However, there's currently a new transit train under construction and that one will also have a landside car, pretty much taking over the task of the previous old system. However, that one will also have an airside car, so things will still stay very interesting. This system will open as soon as Terminal 3 will open, which is scheduled to happen in 2026. Alright, that's it. Thank you for your time. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know in the description if you got to tell me something that I missed on or something else. And then have a nice day or a nice flight. Goodbye.